Step one, wear the shittiest of your clothing because you don't want to mess up your nice clothes while you're painting. Step number two is you need your main materials, which is a canvas, acrylic paints, and your paintbrushes. Step number three is you need your other materials, which is something to put under your canvas to protect your surface, a cup of water, and paper towels. And lastly, if you want to, you know, set the atmosphere, set the mood, make yourself a cup of tea, throw on some music, and just, ugh, just paint through that music. Let it go, girl. Let it go. Ooh, paint. Ooh. Getting carried away, let's start. <laughs> Lastly, be sure to sign your art. You gotta let the world know that you made that masterpiece. So just a few tips and tricks if you finish this video and you're just like, oh my god, Haley, I can't do that. Well, think about it this way. You're painting a background, you're doing some brush strokes this way and this way. Then you're doing some lines this way and this way. Then you're splattering paint and you're dabbing paint. And that's really it. Honestly, you can't think too hard when it comes to abstract painting. It's just like, just let it come out. Just do your thing. Just mess around and just don't think too hard about it, okay? Um, but yeah, okay. Um, also, lastly, if you guys create anything um, that's inspired by this or you use this as a guide for your own uh, acrylic, acrylic, abstract painting, uh, please tag me. I would love to see your creations. I love creating with you guys. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. I feel like that's such a lame ending. Like, I literally cringe when I rewatch that part. Bye guys, I'll see you in my next video. I feel like I should just like go back to what I usually do, which is like, deuces, a goodbye. <sighs> oh, no, resist the dab, resist it. Oh, that was hard. Okay, bye guys, see you next time.